Queen City. We're live inside Great American Ballpark in Cincinnati, Ohio. This evening, we've got a matchup out of the NL Central Division between the St. Louis Cardinals and the Cincinnati Red. The Reds have won five games in a row. They'll look for number six right after this. So striding in, Cody Sullivan. it lead things off here in the Way bottom half of the, the first. Red. The catcher, Cody Sullivan. First delivery to him on the way. And he takes a cold strike, 0 and 1. And fellas, we take a look at the Redbirds entering play here tonight. They come in trying to put together a complete ball game as they've lost their last two. Hit hard on the ground towards second. And that will get on through into center field, so he's got himself a leadoff single. So here's Matt Kemp now. He brings a hit streak that currently sits at six games entering play. from the stretch and here's a ball in the air now carrying a bit out toward right center and this is going to get down for extra bases as that will get one if not both of them home and he is in there so here's how the Cardinals are positioned defensively and this team they're not going to be moving around as much as some of the new age teams. The shifting and moving the third baseman over second base and the right fielder to play third base. This is going to be your stationary team trusting pitchers to execute pitches. He's set and the pitch. There's the circle change and a dandy that time as he jumps ahead with strike one. This is a tough guy right here to hit into a double play. He's fast and he swings from the left side. So out of the box he's going to get a good break. He might have to try to get the strikeout right here because very rarely are you going to get this guy to ground into a double play. Here's a look over to first. Runner back safely. Peraza leads off first with one away. Now he goes the other way, and he got a lot of it high and deep to left center field. A leap, but he can't rein it in. It's off the wall. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one-out double. Digging in for his second at-bat, Joey Votto. He singled and scored in his first appearance in this one. Yeah, and just another simple single to the outfield would be a big one right here. Don't try and do too much. You know there's a potential base open right there. Maybe sit off speed. Here's a swing and a long drive high in the air and deep to center field. Bader is there, and that should be deep enough to score the run. Now the relay home. Oh, but the throw is well up the line, and a second run's going to score. Schmidt takes his lead at third with one away. Hard hit ball towards the hole, and just past his outstretched glove into left, the base hit. And that'll put him on the board as it's now a 5-1 ball game. Cody. Digging in the Sullivan. switch hitter, Cody Sullivan, who's got three hits, including a double to this point. He's set. Here it comes. Strike one to start the at-bat. Now the 0-1. Now a fly ball down the left field line, and he's not going to get there. It's down for extra bases. One run scores. Yeah, nowadays the, the number base crunchers base. would number call that 19. a high leverage at bat. Not exactly sure what that means, but what I do know is they just doubled their lead, so he clutched up big time right there. Here's the second baseman, Colton Wong, as the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. Taken called strike two, and now they're down to their final strike tonight. 
And now this crowd of 27,000 plus rise to their feet. He pulls this one into right. Feed is there. Makes the catch and the ball game is over. You can just see that the confidence is radiating off of them out there right now. That's six wins in a row. And this looks like a train that's not about to slow down anytime soon. 8-4 tonight. The Reds cross the plate three times in the eighth, helping propel them to the win. Anthony DiSclafani notches his third win of the year. Michael Walker was only able to work four innings as he takes the loss. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter, at MLB The Show.